Hi, my name is Ryan Deleuze, and this is a video introduction to Alive Pioneer. Alive Pioneer adds a number of new, important measurements to Alive. With prior versions of Alive, you could train only with smoothness and skin conductance level. Now, using the same sensor, you can train directly with BBP amplitude, average heart rate, sweat stability, and even emotions using the new patent-pending Alive Pioneer emotion detection. BVP amplitude is one of the important new measurements available in a live Pioneer. BVP, which stands for blood volume pulse, is the signal that a live uses to determine your heart rate. Each BVP peak is a new heartbeat. The vertical range of this BVP signal reacts very quickly to stress. Stressful events cause a constriction of the blood vessels in the fingers, reducing the amount of blood flow. This leads to a decrease in finger temperature, so BVP amplitude training can be used to replace or supplement finger temperature training. BVP amplitude can also be used instead of skin conductance training for people with low or unchanging skin conductance. In addition to BVP amplitude training, a live Pioneer allows you to train with average heart rate to see large changes in stress or relaxation, heart rate range, which some people prefer as an alternative to smoothness, skin conductance stability, which can be a great measurement to introduce a live to skeptics since it changes so quickly and is easy to control, as well as our new proprietary emotional feedback. Emotional feedback is broken down into arousal and valence. Arousal and valence themselves are determined using a complex combination of many heart rate and skin sweat derived measurements. Arousal is how intense an emotion is. For example, fear and excitement are both high arousal. Valence is how positive an emotion is. For example, fear is low valence excitement or happiness are high valence. These measurements are experimental, as there is no proven method to determine valence using heart rate or skin sweat, but they can be very useful for helping get in touch with emotions, accessing emotions you are not used to experiencing, or shifting from negative to positive emotional states. A live pioneer includes both automatically ranged and manually ranged versions of most measurements. For example, you can set up a custom smoothness difficulty level using the manual version of smoothness, or train with an automatically ranged version of skin conductance level, so you don't need to set starting and target values for skin conductance. You can choose these feedback measurements here on the Alive main menu. If you have two iOMs or Lightstones, you can use many Alive features with two users simultaneously. For example, graph training, where you can see the synchronization between two clients, or measure client and therapist together to see synchronization between them. Also, you can play dual drive with two users in a cooperative mode, where one player controls the speed of the car and the music volume, and the other player controls the fog. Together, you clear the fog and speed up your car to win. Alive Pioneer includes many additional new features, including a number of new environments targeted to train specific feedback, such as BVP amplitude, heart rate range, or emotion. There are new graphs for each Alive Pioneer measurement, as well as the full monitoring graph, which lets you see many measurements at once. You can also now add an unlimited number of additional graphing screens to construct the exact view you want. Alive Pioneer is designed for the IOM or Lightstone sensors, but some measurements are also available for the M-Wave sensor. For more information, check the Alive Pioneer user guide PDF or watch the detailed video walking you through all of the Alive Pioneer features. Thanks for listening, and I hope this helps you get the most out of all of the new Alive measurements, environments, graphs, and two-user training.